Hey there lovely people, welcome to your own Anacademy Neat English channel. I'm Dr. Pankuri Meglani, your biology educator. A quick hi to all my beautiful students. Well, I'm hoping and praying and wishing that all of you are vigorously preparing for your Neat 2024 exam. Today, I'm going to be talking about five common mistakes done by most of the Neat aspirants. These mistakes could actually cost you your selection, even if everything else is fine. And if you are able to avoid these mistakes on a daily basis, well, it can take you to your destination. Now, the very first mistake that I see is living in the past. Stop labeling your preparation as anything, a good, a moderate or a bad preparation. Stop considering your mock test score as the final score. Move progressively upwards and forwards. The second mistake that I see people doing is not having a daily timetable. Well, weekly and monthly targets are very good, but you have to bind yourself into a daily timetable, which is going to show you the mirror, whether you were productive or not so productive. I recommend that you have a 12 hour timetable every day because that is how much you would need to do all the subjects, all the four subjects in a single day. Yeah, do all the subjects and if on a certain day you were not able to finish your timetable, don't get demotivated. I repeat, don't get demotivated. Make a fresh timetable the very next day and you have 12 more hours to add your backlog of the previous day. Yes, the third mistake, you focus too much on the quantity, the study material. I will read from this book, that book, this study material, that study material. No, now is the time in the remaining days. If you want to succeed, get to the source of all the MCQs and all the subjects. I mean it, all the subjects. And that is none other than our NCERT. I recommend a minimum of five readings of NCERT till your exam. Now people, there's a catch here. I want you to associate yourself with a teacher or a batch which decodes NCRT for you, which decodes NCRT for you. There is no use studying NCRT in the coded manner as it is. A teacher who guides you that this line of NCRT can give you a question like this, who decodes the diagrams and tables. That reminds me, you can still be a part of the end game batch. The link is given in the description box. Everything required for your preparation, you guys know it, is done by the teachers. Now people, the next mistake. Yeah, you guys escape this. I know, I know. PYQs and the mock tests. I will give the mock tests in the last two months of my preparation. PYQs, I will do once the chapter or the topic is over. I want you to go through that drill of solving questions every day. Again, get out of your comfort zone. That's the real deal. Now, at this point of your preparation, since this is the final lap, please, these PYQs, please, should involve the previous year papers of need. Yes, because these papers are speaking of the pattern of the expected paper, the pattern of the questions, the weightage of every chapter. Yes, you get to see your weakness and strength every day and you work on them the very next day. Today is the day that you do your PYQ and minimum of 10 year papers, 2014, 2050, downloaded on your table every day. Mock test people, every Sunday of the week, I want you to give a minimum of 60 mock tests of full syllabus. Yes, that simply means that every Sunday should be dedicated to a test. Even if you score less in the beginning, it is okay. That is the drill. Now, the next and the final and the one who's going to take care till the end is the health. If there's no health, it is going to impact your retention of concepts. See, this competitive exam is how much you retain of this huge syllabus that you learn for two years and how strong is your memory. That is what matters on the final day. Yeah, along with accuracy and time management, yes. So, in order to retain the concepts and have a strong memory, you have to take care of every aspect of your health. It is mental health, it is emotional health, it is your physical health. Yeah, they are always impacting each other. Now, to take care of your mental health, I tell you, there are no marks ever, ever given for worrying too much. 
yeah again goes back to living in the past live in the present and make sure that next day is better than the previous one start improving take your own responsibility you don't need motivation from anywhere else but from yourself yeah be a better version of yourself the next day so worrying can only lead to formation of stress hormones in the body don't let that happen to you then comes the comparison which most of you do you don't have to compare yourself with somebody doing better or somebody doing even lesser than you yes you are your own competition then the physical health it is going to impact the mental health take care of your food in terms of quality and quantity both yes both of them matter make sure you have a balanced diet keep away your favorites for the next 3 3 and a half 4 months it is okay if i eat simple sugars simple fats proteins lot of proteins the state of my body is in high metabolism yeah try this uh, wh- when you're sitting to solve those numericals those equations those pyqs and sit on your study table this is not the time to lie down somewhere to lie down on the bed yeah and uh, be lazy okay so, so eat a simpler food then sleep in terms of sleep people quality really matters how deep is your sleep yeah the number of hours do matter i recommend 6 to 8 hours but even if you keep lying down on the bed worrying and you don't go into the deep phase of the sleep it is not going to help you with the retention you're not going to feel fresh you will be less productive and it is definitely not going to help with the memory make a fixed routine most of you have a dwindling changing routine every day now is not the time you need to condition your body okay to sleep at the same time eat at the same time every day routine is important it is okay to sacrifice this much for something as big as selection through neat 2024 be blessed be happy be a good person and rest everything will be taken care of when i speak about the tests people yes when i speak about the tests an academy has launched the scholarship test you can register for it and use the code pm1 live you can use this code to opt for of course you have the end game batch i can ex subscription plus subscription if you want access to any batch use this code for the discounted price and definitely this is a mandatory thing that you go for the scholarship test because i just spoke about the importance of the tests yes keep smiling and for more such amazing updates tune into an academy needs english channel right now